dear students in this video we will do a small discussion about the shape of interference fringes if we do a fresnel biprism experiment in this experiment if we uh, uh, watch the fringes then we can see that shapes of fringes are like this it means it means uh, state in straight lines these are the shapes of fringes and we can see if it is bright dark bright dark but actually uh, these are the practical shapes but uh, actually uh, if we see the path difference suppose these are two coherent sources s1 and s2 and it is a screen and suppose this is a observing point p and this is a path difference and we know that path difference is s2p minus s1p and for maximum intensity at point p it becomes equal to n lambda and if this path difference s2p minus s1p represents the minimum intensity that it becomes equal to twice n plus 1 lambda by 2 if n for uh, a particular n if n is fixed and uh, we can say that if if n is constant then s2p minus s1p is also constant as wavelength of light is is already constant so we can say that s2p minus s1p is constant and this equation represents uh, the equation of hyperbola hyperbola and which with the focus of this s1 s2 it means actual shapes of actual fringes are this is s1 this is s2 shapes of actual fringes are like this these are the shapes of actual fringes but due to large uh, eccentricity we can see only that part if we see uh, by the help of telescope we see only that part and it is uh, we can see only a straight part straight line straight line and that's why when we see the shapes of fringes we can see only the straight lines and in the form of uh, bright and dark fringes okay this is the explanation uh, of uh, why we see the straight line uh, however the shapes of fringes are hyperbolic okay thank you